What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Little Savage, and I'm back with a live video. I'm sorry I haven't po been posting in a while, like a week. I just been kind of busy, and you know, I didn't really have time. But I do have time now since my schedule this week is already like set. So let's get into this video. Um, sorry. What's new? This video is gonna be like what's new, a little update, what's going on. I'm quitting YouTube. I'm just kidding. I'm not quitting. I'm just beginning. So let's see. Before we get into this video, make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, and turn your post notifications on. And you'll be entering a new giveaway. Like I said, once I hit 300 subscribers, I'll do that. I'm on my way to like 200 subscribers right now. I'm like 170 right now. Thank you guys all for subscribing to my channel and watching my videos. You know, I'm not doing it for the money. That's a lie. Um, but I'm just doing it to like, you know, since the coronavirus is going around, you don't really have nothing to do. So I just do it so I won't be bored. Because, you know, sometimes my friends don't want to hang out. So I'm like, yeah, I'm doing myself a video or something. Entertain people. Because I love to entertain. So I want to just give you like a little update of what's going on. And yeah, so basically, uh, what's coming to my channel? I still got like tons of ideas, pranks and stuff coming soon. I'm, it, I'm working on it. Okay, I'm trying to make time. She said, "What's your?" You know it. I cut that out. Uh, So, I always losing my train of thought when they come to my room with Margaret. Uh, what was I saying? Um, see, I can't even think right now. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's, I have a brain fart. Like I was saying, um, a lot of, there's more videos coming to my channel pranks vlogs whatever so i have a lot of stuff planned for this channel the, like i said the only reason why i made a channel is to entertain people if you guys are having like a bad day gloomy outside you guys can watch my videos like i said i'm very entertaining um little update about me what's going on let's start off by saying i'm back at work how exciting because you know I didn't really talk about what why I why I got suspended from work or why they try to fire me I'm gonna just give you like a brief summary of why so there was this girl at work she ended up getting what suspended and then fire sorry I need a burp that's why I'm looking down and basically she was like since I'm going down this this is probably what she was thinking in her head if she had a brain, you know. She was probably thinking, um, since I'm going down, I'm going to take some people down with me. So basically, she ended up screenshotting my video on YouTube. How to make a pizza from home. And basically, she screenshotted my video. She sent it to corporate. And basically, she was trying to get me in trouble. But, you know... At first, I was mad when my supervisor told me, oh, turn in your, turn in your key. Um, I have to suspend you for further notice. I'm like, what's going on? No one's selling me anything. You know, I had to wait for, like, HR. To, I had to call HR when I, once I got home. I'm like, um, I text him. I'm like, hey, um, this is Israel from blah, blah, blah. I just want to know, like, what's going on. Nobody's telling me anything. Why I got suspended or... Why am I, my, why am I, you know, suspended or why am I, what's going on? You know, it's just a why, W-H-Y question mark. Why, why, why are you suspending? Are you trying to fire me? Did I do something wrong? And I told I text the supervisor, I text my ma store manager. They couldn't really talk to me because 
once someone is suspended, they can't really have contact with them. And I totally understand. At first, I was mad and bummed, like, oh, I'm going to lose my job. And second day, I was like, you know, it's just a job. There's a lot of job opportunities out there. And, you know, um, once I got home, I told my mom. She was like, um, she had bad no soup for me. She was like, oh, your dog jumped on the woman else the little girl upstairs. But thank God she didn't tell her mom because I would have gotten in trouble. And I told her I got suspended for further notice. And yeah, the, basically that girl was trying to get bring me down with her since she got fired. But you know, they didn't really have anything on me. Like I did make a pizza at home, but I didn't really have uniform on. The only thing I had was like my hat from work. And I, did, I had like a shirt from my house and an apron. Like the apron doesn't say where I work, but the hat did. But Basically, they told me that um, what I heard, that they didn't want to lose me because I was a good worker. I've been in the company for like that many years and they didn't want to afford to lose somebody good. And I had to write like a whole freaking essay about why I want my job. And you know, I honestly put some words in it on my own and honestly, I didn't really care. So I just like made something up. Not really, but, you know, I tell them, like, there's people there that actually I consider family. And that that's true. Like, I do consider people that are family. And then, next day, I got a call, what up? Like, she was like, hey, this is, you know, such and such from Human Resources. I could. Let's Let's Sorry about that. Like, there's... Daddy, come in my room. Marley, you know. She was like, yeah, this is blah, blah, blah from Human Resources. I just want to for you. I got some good news for you. You could come back to work. And I was like, great. I have to go back to work. And then once I got back to work, I told my favorite manager what was going on. She was like, sorry, I, we nobody can't really talk to you. But she ended up reaching out to me as like a friend and she was like the only one like trying to give me like hope and you know courage like oh they might give you your job back they don't have anything on me and then my store manager was like sorry man i can't be talking to you when you're suspended i told him i totally understand and you know honestly i was mad the first day second day i didn't really care because i could i have a backup plan like oh i'm gonna lose my job file for unemployment, find a second job, do a resume, or a manager, you could, you have so many job opportunities, so I was like, that's what, I've been straight up, like, I've been straight up with the HR woman, too, I'm like, you guys don't have anything on me, yeah, like, a camera in the store, it could be, like, copy, like, Photoshop, like, oh, it could seem like I've, I've been taking something, but I honestly never stole from that store honestly like everything i own i buy so they didn't really have anything on me i like i never stole money from that place you know like i make my own money and basically that girl was trying to give me fire i no longer talked to her i blocked her from every social media no con human contact like you know it's kind of you know effed up because I was like friends with her, not friends, but co-workers, whatever. Like I was always nice. There was one time when she got mad cause I get, get her right up, but I can't give her right up. I'm doing my job, you know, like I'm a manager. The crew, you don't have to tell the crew members more than once. You could, you don't basically, um, basically as a manager, you, you, um, what's the word? You tell them once, you don't have to keep repeating yourself. You don't have to keep telling them twice. And then, you know, I, I wrote her up. I wrote her up twice. Cause she did, did something that she was not supposed to do. That's my job, writing up people. Like, I have the authority to. I'm like, one of those managers, if you don't do your stuff or you, you get warned or a write up or you're supposed to clock out on your time. If you don't, I'll clock you out myself. Basically, 
I'm not gonna talk about that subject anymore. Like, it's done. Yeah, I almost got fired, but I'm grateful that um, I'm back working there. And you know, my friends from work that I consider family, they were super sad. They were about to cry. I'm like, they're like, oh, you better come back. And I was like, yeah, I'll be back. You know, um, like my store manager, he was. Not, you know, he didn't really want to show emotions because I heard that he was sad. So, yeah. On to the next topic. What else is new? Um, Minimal wage went up. Basically, I'm making $15 an hour now. And, you know, that extra dollar can help. Because, yeah. I actually ordered me some stuff off of Amazon since... I don't really want to be around people at the gym. So I ordered me some weights. So I'm going to work out on my body. Ab workout. I'm not getting fat or anything. I just want to, you know, because I'm like the perfect weight for my height. So I'm um, basically, um, I ordered me some weights. But the downfall for, for it is they, on the Amazon thing, it says it's supposed to come in like a month. In August, it says around August twenty something. We're in July. We're like in the basically like the first week of July, and it says August twenty something. So you know I have to wait. So I'm cutting back on the junk food, soda. I'm just drinking Seven Up right now, but you know, cause I'm eating a gyro, and you know, what is that? Oh, somebody sent me a code. Basically, um, basically, yeah. Oh, I had a, um, I had to update my insurance, my life insurance, not life insurance, my health insurance, because the old insurance I had was County Care or Blue Cross Blue Shield, and basically they said I don't qualify for that because I make too much money. So basically, I got qualified for this new insurance. I just took it. It was basically forty dollars a month. It starts next month on the first. So that's good. It, I have like basically like a hundred, two hundred dollars off of contacts. So I could basically like get contacts now. But you know, look at my glasses right now. Like if you guys could see, they're not even like attached. I had a crazy glue them basically because they fell off and then this screw came off today so basically i had like spectacles you know back in the day um basically like these two pieces right here i didn't have that i had to fix it when i got home so i crazy glued both sides and then this side looks brand new but this one's like all effed up because it has like a lot of crazy glue on it and you know i had to fix that and so i get better glasses because i'm blind without glasses and i can't barely see anything and i can't really see see anything like i said i'm like nearsighted that means where you can't see far away i'm super blind so yeah i have to wait till my insurance hit they said august 1st and then i can get context probably next week i have to go get a id a brand new id oh what else is new thinking about getting a new tattoo honestly finishing like updating this tattoo at like angel angel wings and then a halo i'm thinking about that i'm waiting on my taxes too i know there is supposed to be here they said people that did a tax amendment said um paper checks come they take a while to come so i'm waiting on my taxes still i'm getting like two g's I'm going to use that for a car. I'm getting a car. Uh, my grandma's friends are going to teach me how to drive. I texted her yesterday, but she still hasn't responded back. I'm like, I got $10 You can, um, for gas. I can use that for your gas if I waste any. And you could give me driving lessons since I'm off from work. Since, you know. So I'm going to learn how to drive. My license. Planning to do that. Um, planning to move out soon, like maybe a year or so. So yeah, I'm trying to make this short. I'm not trying to make this so long. I do need a shave. I got a haircut like a week ago, 
but it's already growing back since the type of haircut I get. Um, that's new. There's like this lit TV show. I'm gonna probably do a reaction a video about it tomorrow. It's called Star Girl. Like I told you, I love DC, the DC universe. Um, it's actually like legit cool because I got my um, mom into my sister. Probably my brothers will like it too. I, wa I just watched the episode not too long ago. I just finished episode eight. It's only eight, one season just came out. And it's like, it's really, it's really cool. Like, honestly, I'm gonna do a reaction video about that. Like, you guys will like it. And you guys should check that out too. That'd be probably in the next video or the next upcoming video. I'm gonna try to be more active on you, YouTube. And yeah, it's honestly, I, I can't, I'm still thinking about like the episode I just watched and I can't wait for next week's episode. Like all the times when a TV show comes out or like I finish a TV show, like I'm gonna honestly watch the next episode. I should just take like a few weeks. I'm not watching it and that kind of episode back to back. But that show has me hype. I really like it. I It's five stars and no doubt uh yeah and then uh, my grandma got me a gift for a video back to the pizza video ba basically she got me a lot of pizza stuff so i guess she wants me to do a video of how to make a pizza at home that's a little i'm gonna do that but i'm not gonna add my job logo into it so i'm just gonna be like how to make a homemade pizza at home featuring israel so i'm gonna do that um, I had bad news yesterday. Basically, my great uncle passed away. But the now, it's kind of effed up because he his brother knew about it three months ago, basically. And recently, my my other great uncle, that was his brother, also just found out yesterday, and he informed the family. So all the family is taking it hard, especially my grandma, because that was her brother. My other aunt, my great aunt, um, my mom was crying. My uh, my aunt Kim was crying, and then they were like, "That's effed up. How could you know? You know, families have their um, their um, fa basically families have effed up childhoods and family tree, and you know the whole family tree is kind of effed up where you guys." backstab and screw each other up that's how family is not supposed to be that like yeah he basically he died like three months ago and we recently found out yesterday and you know it's not basically it's not taking like a big effect on me because yeah i talked to him on the phone before but i didn't really actually like met him in person but yeah i kind of feel like that for like them going through that especially my grandma my great aunt i'm like i'm here if you need anything um and the downfall is like they don't know where his body's at they don't know if he's cremated they don't even know where he's at basically he should have been buried like next to his mom that passed away in like 20 i want to say 26 20, yeah, around 2015, his mom passed away. And he should be buried next to his mom. But they don't even know where he, his body's at. Like, how did he die? And, you know. It's kind of after how his brother did that. And, you know. I'm, I'm just sharing it. I'm not trying to put no business out or a family business. But I'm just sharing it with you guys. Like, what's going on? A little update. And... You know, I don't know if, like, he he knew about it and then he just want to drain his life insurance, like, take everything. Like, if that's the case, that's kind of effed up because I would never do that to so none of my siblings or family or my mom. Like, life insurance is supposed to be for that person, make sure they get a proper burial, a uh, tombstone, bury at a certain place you want them buried to or next to. And, you know, that's kind of, you know, after, but, you know, 
I don't know what he, what he was thinking. Like, he's probably screwed up in the head. And, you know, only God could judge, judge him. And then he, his brother's probably looking down at him and his mom. They're probably like, you know, that's crazy. And, you know, and, you know, I'm not going to get into my mom's boyfriend. Um, you know, that's a different topic I don't even want to talk about. Um, yeah, basically that's it. This video is over with. Make sure, if you guys enjoyed my little update, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and share post notifications on. And I'll be back tomorrow with a, with a reaction video. See ya.